go? We're lashing the uh, coil springs from the seat onto the webbed deck. When you get the shot of the uh, front side of this, you'll see the, the jute webbing. And what I'm doing is I'm sticking a very long needle through the uh, burlap scrim and the webbing, which is um, with all thread. And I'm going over the uh, spring orbits in four different positions. So push this back through. The, you'll be able to see the needle come back through. There it is. So right here is the orbit of the spring. I'm going to pull the thread completely through and create a, a um, slip knot. To just double that knot to where it can't slip back out and pull it down tight. You can see this number four looks like a number four uh, positioning. This is just simply locking four positions of the orbit of the spring. If you were to see it from the other side, the bottom orbit of the spring would be sitting against the webbing just like this. We're going to come up to the top of the spring orbit. And pull through, and now you'll be able to see, when I come back through, you'll be able to see a locking stitch, which is very useful to not have to let go of the needle and take everything apart in order to create a knot. So. We're going to catch this side coming back over the top of the orbit. Can you see that? Yes. Okay. It's going to come back through. Now you're going to want to come to the other side and see this is what's left of the string. This is the left of the string. Go around the needle once. Going, what is that? Counterclockwise. Counterclockwise. And I'm going to come back around the, the needle clockwise once and drop the loop down. That creates an opposing knot, believe it or not. Believe it or not. Out comes the rabbit through the hole, and it just starts to cinch down. If I'm lucky, it will cinch all the way down. There we go. That's tight. Uh-oh. Well, see, I wasn't paying attention, and so I caught one of an extra orbit of the spring. Bring the camera on around and you can show them what happens when you don't pay attention. Eey. That's what happens when you don't pay attention. So I'm going to try and pull this back out and see if I can actually do this without breaking the string. Maybe that knot is not cinched down so tightly that I won't be able to... Ah, I broke it.